In this episode, I'm going to tour through a home that can be built in Lori Park, Lake Nuna, with the garage apartment. Stay tuned. Hey guys, Joe with Orlando Home Finders, and today I'm in Lake Nuna showcasing a beautiful home that you could build a second floor garage apartment. So a lot of these are very popular for rentals. You can basically rent out that back of the home and pay for half your mortgage. That's a great feature. So this house is a two story. It has four bedrooms, three and a half baths, and a two car garage standard. But you can upgrade that two car to a three car, and then that three car into a garage apartment. You can also do a garage, two and a half car garage apartment as well. But as you see, this house also has an additional bonus room up front. So this square footage can be bumped up to close to 3,000 square feet or a little bit over. But as you see, this is a primary down. Also, it has the secondary bedrooms upstairs. So if this is a good option, if you're looking to purchase a home in Lake Nona or Orlando, please give me a call 407-484-8458 or email me at orlandofinders at gmail.com. If you haven't already, please like this video, subscribe, and comment below. I'd love to hear your comments. For now, enjoy the tour. This is the craft elevation. So you can see this one has an upgraded travertine porch with a nice sitting area. Eight foot glass door. This has an elegant foyer. As you can see, you have this gorgeous feature wall. I have not seen this ever. I've been trying to find it. I don't even know how they did it, but it is seamless and it is beautiful. Right away, you're gonna see this is open concept. Right away, you're gonna see you're walking into your family room. This will be where you put your TV on the left. That really works out the best for this floor plan. You'll have your natural light coming through these windows, three windows, and then you have that glass window. Right away, you're gonna see you have your tray ceiling. Very tall ceilings. I believe these are 10 foot ceilings. Yes, they are. And then you're gonna, you can see right away they have the crown moldings to make it extremely elegant. You have the LED puck lights and your speaker system. So this is very cool. This is your family room. And then right behind me, you have your really oversized kitchen. I have not seen something like this in a while. I filmed this quite a while ago, but Seeing this again, it brings back those memories. You have your T-shaped island, so you'll have a lot of seating all the way around. If you use backless stools, you'll be able to get a lot back there, but this has the high-end quartz. Then cabinets for days. I'm gonna back up a little bit. Something that you don't see right away is your pantry. So that shelving right there in the middle will be your pantry. So you have extended cabinets and countertops. While we're back here, might as well take a look at this kitchen nook, perfectly situated in this area here. So tons of cabinets, including this. So this will replace your walk-in pantry. There's a lot of space to be utilized right there. Another thing that you're gonna realize here this looks like a gourmet kitchen, but it really isn't, okay? So you have your industrial modern range hood. Then you have your upgraded slide-in range oven. This is Bosch. I don't believe they're gonna be using Bosch any longer. Then, you, you know, what you see here is your transom window letting in natural light into the center space really well done so these are the light gray classic full overlay cabinets with your crown molding farmer sink and then you have additional space going through here 
really love this. Okay, so you say, hey, typically you're gonna have a microwave up there. Okay, so for gourmet kitchen, you have a microwave and oven on the wall. This has a microwave option on the cabinet right there, the lower cabinet. Very, very well done. All right, so again, you have your kitchen nook with your triple slider going into your upgraded covered living area. So that's gonna be very unique, otherwise it's going to be um, open. All right, so before I head out back here, let's do a little zigzag. All right, back here will be your half bath. I really love the wallpaper. Then you have your vessel sink on this modern wood pedestal. Really love it. And then you have your, boom. Laundry room, upgraded sink, upgraded cabinets, upgraded tile floors throughout. And then this would be your exit or entryway from your garage. All right, before we go up the second floor, this is a primary down. This is a beverage station with open shelving. You have your beverage refrigerator, very cool. Again, when you come into your primary, you have another beverage station, which is very cool. I have not seen that. I have not seen that. That even has a backsplash, quartz countertops. Very cool. Check this out. This is gorgeous. All right, so very big space, 10 foot ceilings. And then you have the tray that gives you that extra. And then you have that wallpaper and the tray that defines it. Really interior design in this room is gorgeous. You can see how much elbow room you have, king size bed with the oversized drawers. Two windows in front of the home, and then you have two walk-in closets. As you see, it has the custom California style shelving. This one is definitely larger. My wife would pick this room for sure. Another view here. So in addition to the two windows in the front, you have two transom windows. Love this barn door. So that's an upgrade with that really rustic barn door. And then you have this really cool bath. You don't see that every day, all right? So you have your oversized double vanity quartz countertops with your brushed faucet, bronze faucet with your rectangular undermount sinks, additional linen spit closet here, and to the left is the water closet, of course. Let's talk about this space here. polished tile going to the ceiling. I love that long transom window, shampoo and shower uh, soap niche. You have your pebble flooring here. This is an upgrade with the tub inside here. That is so cool. Very cool. Again, you have your large format vertical polished tiles and 50-50. It's really cool. I love it. Very modern. Whoa, again, the frame the shower with a little bit of framing. Very beautiful. All right, so let's go to the second floor. Again, look at the architectural staircase, how it goes from those wide treads to the narrow treads. Actually, it's still wide. So when you look at the side here, these are open treads. So you can see the full stairs. Then you have your handle, the upgraded chrome spindles. Are those chrome? They're brushed. Upgraded brush spindles. Even the landing has hardwood, hardwood with the white risers. 
really wide. So that's another thing. Typically this would be, I think for this uh, builder, they're gonna have white spindles. But this is something that would end, and this is an upgrade. This is awesome. All right, so we hit sunset. You can see that beautiful sunset in the background. This is an additional room. I believe it's like 45,000 for this. Really great additional space for this home. Again, 10 foot ceilings. On the second floor, three bedrooms. I mean, three windows here, and then two windows over there. This is so cool. Transom windows over there. Transom windows over here. I should turn on some lights. I should turn on these hallway lights. Huh? Yes. There you go. 10 foot ceilings, 8 foot doors. It just feels so amazing up here. The space is really, man. Sorry for filming at night, but it's, five, it's almost 6 o'clock. Actually, they're closing up. This is an ensuite. Look at all the windows. Three windows. And then this has a standard closet. I'm gonna start running through here because these are your final. I don't want to take up the time. Hmm. Love it. Subway tile 5050. Gray quartz with the white. That's awesome, love it. Then you have another, this is a Jack and Jill. Let's walk into this huge closet here. Wow, 10 foot ceilings, I'll say it again. Gives you that space, another bedroom. Final room here, bath. This is the share Jack and Jill. Gray, the white, double vanity. This is the shower, transom window. All right, and then the final room. Let's back it up. This is a great, these are all great size rooms. This floor plan is really great. I love it. And this is uh, standard. It comes with a two car garage. Then you could upgrade it to a three car garage. And then you could upgrade it uh, each to have something on top. Uh, what I mean by that, by you could put a two car garage, you could put a loft on top of the two car garage, but this is your custom covered lanai this is upgraded. You could see you have the wood paneling on the ceiling. It's covered, so typically it is a shallower lanai. This would be your entryway to your three-car garage. This has the upgraded three-car garage. It's currently being used as an office, but this is your garage apartment. Again, it has that architectural wall, so beautiful. Hardwood stairs with the white risers. This has a great feel to it. So this apartment seems, it's definitely a lot longer. It's a little shallower, but it really has that nice feel of a lot of space. You have 10 foot ceilings in here as well. This has your espresso cabinets. These are engineered hardwood floors. 
Over here on the left, you have your pantry. So this can offset your ink, your mortgage by a lot. This is your bedroom. It has a lot of room. That's a queen size bed. This also has two walk-in closets, one over there, and then one over here. Laundry room, stackable, and then a large bath. So this is really a wonderful option. Hey guys, what do you think about this home? It is a very unique, fantastic home. I love this floor plan especially with that garage apartment. So if you're interested in purchasing a home here in Orlando, Lake Nona, or in the Orlando Central Florida area, please give me a call. I'd love to be your real estate resource of choice. Give me a call at 407-484-8458 or email me at orlandofinders at gmail.com. So this house, as you see, is two stories, just under 2,800 square feet, but with the bonus room up top, you're gonna to be close to 3,000 square feet and then additional square footage on the garage apartment. So it's four bedrooms and has three and a half baths, two car garage, can be upgraded to three car garage or two and a half, three car garage apartment or two and a half car garage apartment. So this house has a lot of features, a lot of upgrades. So if you want to see it again, please give me a call. I would appreciate that. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe to this channel. Hit the bell for instant notifications. Like this video and comment below. I truly enjoy your comments. I try to smile as fast as I can, if I can. Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me on the tour. Have an amazing day, and I'll see you around the neighborhood.